first of all, thanks to all my players, my staff, all the team, which was helping us to fulfill everything we wanted to do in the last two weeks. So congratulations to everyone in AIFF. And I'm especially happy because of people in India who gave us a positive comments after we lost first game. They were happy about the way we played, how we organize the things on the pitch now. And I promised I will be doing that in the future as well. So I'm especially proud of the players because as you see, so many young players we put in the team. Today there was only one player who played against Thailand in AFC Cup. So it's a big, big change. It's a massive change and as a final result, I have exactly what I wanted to have in my first phase of work. I have competition in my team for every place. And that's what makes me very happy as a coach. I'll try to be modest always, but to answer you honestly on your question, I was a defender playing on the top level. So I think I can show the few things and work on their weaknesses. And what is that is what we've been doing in the last two weeks. Explaining things to them, working on the pitch. And the result was today massive defending game. Our center backs were so good with the help of the full backs and defensive midfielder. That was just fantastic. Clean sheet, nothing to say to them. Just congratulations. I mean, the game could go either way. You know, after we scored the goal, of course, we gave to Thailand possession on the ball. We didn't insist on possession. We tried to wait and heard them on contra-attacks. And we had one of these situations when two of my players were a little bit <coughs> undecisive in front of the goalkeeper. We could have finished the game in the first half. We didn't. And then second half was again Thailand playing well, very organized, coming on the sides, trying to put quality crosses. But as I said before, my defenders were top class today. That was just not possible for Thailand to, to score today with my defenders working like this. In AFC Cup game, Thailand had 70% possession, as I remember. Yeah. But in today's game, until we scored the goal, I think that, that we were better in possession. That we were passing and moving better than Thailand. I changed a few things on purpose after we scored the goal because I have many unexperienced players who can lose their head during the game. So I wanted them to give a free at the back from Thailand to pass, to move and concentrating to close the gaps in the middle. So that was the reason why the game changed maybe in possession after we scored. You know, but that was that was on purpose. You could see that if we want to keep passing and moving, we can do that even with a better size like Curaçao, what we did in the second half with them. Having possession, keeping them back in their box and creating chances, you know. Thank you. Of course there is a chance for Vietnam, of course. This is football. We all have a chance. It only depends are we going to take it or not, you know. Who could believe that Croatia would go to the final of the World Cup? There was a chance, we took it. Who could believe that Leicester will become champion of Premier League? They took their chance, they worked hard, they believed, they dreamed, and they took their chance. Everyone has got a chance. That's why we all love this sport so much. Everyone has the chance.